Well, this is about as decorated a kickboxer as has come into this division in some time, DC. And if we get a kickboxing match tonight, he ain't losing. He is a championship-level kickboxer, a guy that can stand in the pocket and trade and kick and punch with anyone. He's constantly throwing things from as close as you can get. He's comfortable throwing leg kicks. He will drive knees into your body. But it's the aggressiveness and the ability and willingness to stand in the pocket and trade that makes him truly, truly special. I think that is what separates kickboxing, the high level yeah. from everyone else. He understands distance as well as any striker in this division. Of course, that is a byproduct of a lifetime of repetitions in the kickboxing space. All right, so here he is, the undefeated Israel Adesanya, his crowning achievement, at least to this point in time, UFC 236, a monumental, unanimous decision win over Kelvin Gastelum in what was one of the best title fights you or I have ever seen. One of the greatest fights of all time. And to watch Israel Adesanya go out in round five, when the fight is on the line and have his very best round of the fight was inspiring for anyone that likes mixed martial arts. If you're a fan of a young guy like Israel, to see him do that, to earn that title, is very, very assuring as he's getting ready to go forward in his career. To achieve that goal in such a short amount of time is truly, truly unheard of. Hard tail of the tape for this heavyweight fight. Two years apart, these two fighters, with big differences in height and reach. We send it inside the octagon. Here's Bruce Buffett. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Eve Loving. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the MGM Grand Garden Arena in Las Vegas. It's time! Five rounds in the UFC heavyweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a kickboxer, holding a professional record of 19 wins, four losses. He stands five feet eight inches tall, weighing in at 135 pounds. Fighting out of Walburn, Massachusetts, Rob Fox! And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, holding a professional record of 21 wins, one loss. He stands six feet four inches tall, weighing in at 185 pounds. Israel, the last dial bender. Okay, guys, protect yourself at all time. Obey my command at all time. If you want to touch love, do it now. Go back to your corner. Let's get this one started here. Round one is underway. And we've got a striker who is a force to be reckoned with. Tonight, though, he draws a guy who can do a little bit of everything. And that guy is usually the one that will have the advantage. But we know what a high-level striker is. And this guy is as high-level as oh, we've ever seen. Back to the feet. Nice connection with that punch. It's one thing to have an edge in reach. It's another to take advantage. Nicely done. Big punch lands over the top. How's he going to follow this one up? Right punch is good. The left also flush. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this gentleman. Huge uppercut. Lands a kick there, pretty well done. Really good accuracy landing that kick. He's throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. 
beautiful strike. Beautiful leg kick thrown. Ooh. Oh, straight right. Missed with that right hand. Oh, nice job by him there to slip that offer. Big ball punch lands. Now he gets back to range. So just over 20 total strikes have landed for Israel Adesanya. Oh! He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Oh, he might be out. Planted and fired there. Landed to the body. An uppercut landed. And now he lands a combination. Got him. And he caught the kick. We'll see what he can do with it. Well, DC, headgear's not allowed, but he has raised the hands, and he's doing a nice job protecting the dunk. He's doing a great job of blocking his head. A lot of times, those shots to the head will knock you out. Not this time. This guy's making sure nothing lands. Straight right. Oh! Nice. Oh, no. Adesanya gets hit with a kick here. That one landed flush. Let's see if he can make some adjustments. Look at him working at trying to shut the liver down. Nice punch lands. Man. Good right here. Oh, nice combination. Oh! It's okay. Oh, wicked nice leg kick there, DC. Can't take too many of those. Just out of range with that left hook. And he landed the right hand there. Oh, beautiful jab there. It's one thing to have length. Of course, it's another to use it effectively. Beautiful job with that jab. Look at how he turns his hip over when he throws that kick. 45 seconds remain in the round. Checks that leg kick. Trying to establish that jab once again. And he connects with a punch there. We'll see if he can follow it up. He's landed that punch over and over again. What's he going to do to follow up? Ooh, head kick lands. He's hurt. 15 seconds. Nice leg kick there by Adesanya. Oh! All right, there's the end of the round. We'll show you some of the highlights. It must feel pretty damn good to knock a man down like that. It feels good to knock a man down. And most times, you don't even feel it. It's the ones that you don't even recognize that landed hard are the ones that usually put your opponent out. It landed right on the sweet spot, and he hurt his opponent very badly. Just missed on the front kick there. Oh, and he connects there. His hands look good to him. So fast. I mean, this guy has tremendous hand speed. Both fighters hanging down in the pocket and both landing. Wild swing there. Oh, beautiful land there by Adesanya. You hear this crowd just eating out of his hand, on and on every time he advances. I mean, he just captures your imagination from the walkout to the entrance when he's in. Whoa! 
And just like that, the fight is over. It's over. It's over. <laughs> just the way he drew it up as he gets the knockout victory here tonight, it's hard to land a strike more flush than he did right there. And I'm not even sure the opponent saw it coming. So he'll see the replay and probably shake his head. But ultimately, this is a huge result and a huge win for that fighter here tonight. Well, he's going to enjoy watching this one back. Let's take a look at the replay of the knockout just a moment ago. It was right hand after right hand after right hand. Finally, he found the one that hit the exact sweet spot that ended his opponent's night. Well, hard to perform much better than he did tonight. A huge knockout under the lights. They'll be talking about that one for some time. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Eve Leving has called a stop to this contest at 39 seconds of round number two. Declaring the winner by knockout, Israel, the last title bender, Alessandra. Well, there will be no shutting that smile off tonight. The celebration is on as he gets a huge win by knockout tonight. I got to think there are a few better feelings in the world than walking into an octagon and Candidly knocking another man out. Yeah, you shut a person's lights off, man. There's nothing like it. Now, I understand a lot of times we hope for the knockout.